Hello everyone, so today I'm going to show you how you can make a Merch by Amazon t-shirt design on Canva so as you can know that Canva doesn't support more than 5,000 5, pixels and as you can see and know that Merch by Amazon needs 4, 800 at 5, 400 so what you need to do is put in 5000 at 5000 and create a new design get into here so of course this video is just to show you the method i use so just follow it and i'm not making any design or any tutorial how to design so i'm just showing you how you can use this method to upload it to merch by amazon so of course you made a design to the result of your design so you cannot upload this one because the size isn't working for your uh, merch by amazon to be uploaded so you need to resize it so what you need to do so let's say that this is the design that we worked on so just to go to here you can download it as a png or gpg or a pdf pdf it's uh, more easier so just download pdf standard and click download so you need to have in this case illustrator if you have any other software you can try and see if it works or not dragging it into the software so here it is the design you click embed click ok of course as you can see here if your design has a font like this one here as you can see it changed the font because i don't have the font the name of the font in my computer here you can go and check the name of this font here and download it and you can work with it or get back like here you don't have to embed it this one this this method i will show you now it works also with jpg or png just go to here Click this one here. When the process finished, you click expand here. Now everything on the picture or the PDF. So because this works also on a PNG or GPG. So uh, as you can see, now everything it's an object on the software. So you can double click and choose every element and uh, delay it or get this one here and it choose without uh, double clicking and delay it so let me just do this as you can see here we have this one here you have to delete them still have these two here now as you can see it's just the font so let's just make sure there is nothing else that we slipped on as you can see now it looks nice so now it's a, you can save it as a png save for web and you choose png 24 and maximum and you can save it you can also choose to move these around or uh, anything you want of course or or ungroup them and you choose one element by one this is the video i hope you like it and don't forget to subscribe thank you for watching